Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are, however you are. My name is Terrence O. Gore. I'm the founder of the Artists and Healing Enterprise. The Art of Healing is a dynamic workshop series that employs a collage of creativity, movement studies, mixed media, and artistic expression that enables both teacher and student to attain a higher level of self-awareness. The Art of Healing is a program that I've created to provide a safe space for participants who are living with disabilities, special needs to come and enjoy themselves and identify themselves as artists creatively by having access to a clean, safe, and secure environment to feel creative and understand that they can love themselves unconditionally. There are resources that are needed to keep these programs going. Ultimately, this space that I'd like to have is a 20,000 square foot space that's a safe space that individuals would have accessibility to participate in all of the activities that are made available for everyone of all race, creeds, and colors. The inspiration came about as a result of my own health challenges, where I had to make a choice. Those choices were to either live, live well, or be depressed. I had chosen creativity to be well, continue to be well. This creativity keeps expanding, just as my art does. It goes from one level to the other. I started painting, then I started doing collage on mediums, and then back to movement studies. So it's just a matter of having these spaces for individuals with disabilities to feel as if they're as healthy and normal as other people feel. Because the programs are needed, especially in the crisis that we live with this COVID and limitations that people are dealing with and suffering and depression as a result of it, we need funding to keep these programs going. We need resources. We need these resources that will transport people from one location to the other. I thought that this was a really great opportunity for our children because I'm a special needs teacher and we have a lot of students that we service who have special needs. Those resources will actually be used for marketing, inviting. These resources will provide and support the programs. These programs are programs that are accessible to hospitals, institutions, perhaps incarceration institutions, community-oriented institutions, even in home the program into a safe space in someone's home.